Hey, it's me and Cody somewhere here. Um, I have just been doing some laundry here at home and just kind of cleaning, catching up on things today. But I'm going to head out in a few minutes. There is a container home that's for sale out here. And I've been wanting to see what it looks like inside. So I did get permission from the owner who said is okay to film her house. And I will put info up later in the video. It'll say the price and how to contact the lady for her container home. So I thought you guys would want to go with me and take a look. So we're going to go do that in a few minutes here. Hi Cody. Okay, I just wanted to show you these before I head out. Uh, you can see up here, this is, these are raid, um, like little traps for the windows. And you can see how many gnats it's gotten on there. I just had it up like two days. There are a few on that one as well. So you can see those work pretty good actually. And over here, you can see how many are on the trap and over here as well. So I would say those work really well. They are inexpensive and you can get them at Walmart. Let's look over here. Yep, we even got quite a bit on this. They're called window sheets. Now, I have had this plugged in and I switched between here and the bathroom, but you can see, I mean, it has gotten a few, but I definitely think there is more on the other things that I have, but I'm still keeping that there because at least it's caught some. And here are the glue ribbon. I think these are working really well too. You can see there's quite a few on there. And on this one as well. Look at all of them. So these do work. And again, they are inexpensive. They're like 250. Actually, let me see right here. I have it right here. These fly ribbon. 10 pack, they're less than $3 at Walmart. So just so you know, those work pretty good. And so do these. And they're about the same price. Okay, I got my sunglasses on and we are going to head on down and look at that container home. All right, here we are. This one's for sale. I'll put this on here. So you can see the phone number if you want to contact them about this house. So this one is for sale. And what does it say it is? It says it's an eight by 20. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and look around. And yes, I was given the okay to go in here and film this. Got a nice, pretty big little deck area. Oh, this is nice. A nice lot. Nice big tree. So this is just, oh, the outside, like the doors of this container home. Oh my gosh, my finger. <laughs> finger got stuck. Oh, okay, let's look around. Oh, feels good in here. So this is an eight by 20 <clears throat> container home. And I did put the info, like the number. I put some lights on that tree out there. Nice rug. Oh, I like this. Let's look at the windows. Nice window sill. So this is cute. This is just like, um, let's move this. This is just like my table at home. So it just, Oh, that's a nice height too. That's really nice. That's just like mine at home. All right, so let's look in here. There's the lights. 
Got a pretty big fridge. I don't know if that's a 10 cubic feet or the seven. That's a good size though. I mean, look at the shelving up here. That's nice extra storage. And up here, see this one is at a good height. Mine in my house was up high, quite high. So it was dangerous like when I had a microwave up on mine, when you're getting hot food out. I mean, I was like on my tiptoes. So that is a good height for that. Got the cooktop. I love these counters. Nice sink. It's just like mine. They got quite a bit of space. Drawers. And over here. Got the nice sliding barn door. Bathroom. Whoops. Oh, that's nice. Extra storage. I love that. See, I would do that in my bathroom, but my uh, water heater is in there. So they got a regular toilet in here. Looks like the normal size shower. I'm going to say a 32, which is like mine. So, yeah. Pretty much about the same size as my bathroom. Why do I keep hitting that? All right, let's come out here. And over here, oh, this is nice. Oh, okay. I'm trying to back up enough where you can see because I'm pretty close to it. But you can see you could hang stuff in here, some clothes. Now that is nice. That's a nice use of space. And I'm guessing down here is probably the water heater. Yep. Oh, so we got this over here too. Oh, that, that's a lot of room. It's not bad at all. And then we got this pantry. Oh yeah. It would be nice to have a pantry in my house. This is nice to have. Obviously you're in a tiny home. So you want to utilize every little space. Really do like those countertops. I like the flooring. All right. Well, this is again the eight by 20 container home and it is for sale. I'll go back out and get the info again so you can see if you want to contact the young lady about it. These are nice sturdy steps too. I like that. And you can close these doors or leave them open so that's a nice option. I don't really look around the lot because that is not for sale. I think it's just the container. Here's the outside again. You can see over here. And we'll do the number one more time. Thought you guys might want to see this. Let's head back home. Okay, and that is it. That is a tour of the container home for sale in the forest where I live. I have always thought it was a cute container home. I've always wanted to see what it looked like on the inside. So you got to look at it with me. So if any of you are interested, the number is on the video. You can call them and you know, if you're interested, whatever, all that good stuff. So you should be able to get the number. That is it for now. I am going to go make dinner and walk Cody. And don't forget in the next few days, I'm going to be going on my little adventure. One of a few I have planned. And so just be watching for that video soon. Bye guys.